uh, in your journey, have you come across any mistreatment yourself or un unjust treatment? <laughs> yes. In fact, I almost died as a baby in Pakistan because my grandfather came from a very misogynistic background and he didn't care. Um, uh, he didn't care that uh, I, I was six months old and um, I, ha I got pneumonia. And at that point, my father was working in, in England, sending the money back to, to Pakistan. And the way the culture was, my father had to give all the money to my grandfather. And as soon as my parent, my father and his brothers began working, my grandfather stopped. He sat back and he waited for all the money to come in. So my father was sending the money to my, my grandfather and my mom, my older sister and myself, we were all living in one room of my grandfather's house in Pakistan. And my mother had no access to the money. All the money went straight to my grandfather. And when I got sick, when I was six months old, I got pneumonia and I was almost dying and my grandfather would not send me to the hospital because I was a girl. Now my uncle saw me sick. He ended up taking me to the hospital. He borrowed the money into me and I was saved. And when my father found out, when he came back to visit and he found out how close I was to almost dying, because my mom told me that the night I almost died, she said, I, I was breathing so hard as a baby that my, the sound of my breathing filled the whole room and all night long, she just watched my chest rise and fall, waiting for the sound to stop. Okay. Now, when my father found out, he thought, you know, I can't change the attitudes of the people here. And my father was trying to be a good Muslim. So what he did was he took our family to Canada so that we could he could raise us with his idea of Islam in, in a more egalitarian way. Mm -hmm. And I really do credit my father. I mean, he did the best he could. There were times when he fell short, but he did the best he could in raising us to be equal with my brother. Mm -hmm. And my, my husband is, is, is even better, inshallah. He's mm -hmm. even better in terms of looking at my daughters, trying to help them make their own dreams come true. And in doing that, it makes them happier and there's nothing wrong with it. It actually increases the ummah. It helps everyone uh, because it gives the, it gives the um, services that women can perform for other women. Yeah, oh, mashallah, you've been very blessed to have two wonderful men in your life, your father and your, your uh, husband as fantastic role models. Um, inshallah, there will be more like that. <laughs> That's what we want. We want all the brothers to, to be the same. So 